Stop 36 of the Sunoco Bush Series. We get to the final five events of the season, and we're here back in Atlanta for the Slick 50 300. 20 laps around this famed one and a half mile oval. On the pole, second time this year, Grace Friedman at 190.719 miles an hour. On the outside will be Ed Gardner, the number 93. Row number two will be Christian Brandon, the Dentine Lumina, number. 87 and Andre Castro the winner at the most recent Charlotte event. Row 3 will be our points leader Faith Johnson and Charles Jackson the pole sitter at Kentucky. Row number 4 will be Hayden Klein the pole sitter at Dar the most recent Darlington event and Ann Batson a two time winner. Row number 5 will be Diana Panic, another two time winner and Ralph Green the winner at the most recent Richmond event. Row 6 will be Jeremy Doobie the winner at Hickory and Gabriella Bryan the pole sitter at the op season opening Goodies 300 at Daytona. Then it'll be Matt Richards and Lena Savage, the winner at Milwaukee. Row number eight will be Christina Cowan, right now second in the points, and Julia Leonard, the Nazareth winner. Face sister Emily, the South Boston winner, and Casey Hutchinson will make row number nine. Jacob Rodriguez, the pole sitter at Charlotte and Talladega, the most recent Charlotte event, that is. And Dunlap, our most recent winner at Martinsville, will make row number ten. Tim Gardner and Mike Doobie will make row 11. Gerald Dickmatt and Darnell Jones will make row 12. Darnell was the winner at Kentucky. Gerald was the winner at Talladega. Jason Wong, the pole sitter at the most recent Martinsville event. And Jordan Hetzer will make row number 13. Alexander Wilson Leach, the IRP pole sitter. And Courtney Winterbottle will make row number 14. Nick Knotts and Trey Roberts, row 15. Tim Fralick and Ken Johnson, row 16. Row 17 will be Zed Weinstein and Dougie Shears. Row 18 will be Kelsey McEwen and Jack Richards. Row 19 will be Matthew Rodriguez, the winner at Pikes Peak, and Keith Batson right now third in the points. Adam Fiegel and Celia Brewer will make row number 20. Adam was the pole sitter at Chicagoland. And Adam Chambers, the IRP winner, and Grace Gunnan will tail the field. As we get down to our final five events of the Sunoco Cup and Bush series is what will happen here? Grace Freeman will pull. Ed Gardner will be outside. Right now, the points leader, Faith Johnson, in a very solid fifth starting position, which really helps her. I mean, she will try to, a good finish will also help her more so in padding her points lead, which she had retrieved when she went wire to wire a couple events ago at But the green flag then gets set to fly, nonetheless. Grace Freeman leads the field. Christian Brown in following suit. There is Faith Johnson. All taking the proper lane of choice, which is the inside. Hayden Klein right there. Here comes Christian Brannon. Moving the inside. You got some three abreast racing going on back here, I saw. With Keith Batson. Way up on the high side is the number 27 of Jack Richards. Adam Chambers, Celia Brewer, they drag race in the back of the field. And up here it's getting tighter too. It's Matthew Rodriguez in the mix of things. Looks like it's getting ridiculously tight over here. Nope. Matthew Rodriguez. Courtney Winterbauer. They scatter it out now, so scatter out, then they'll tighten up, and then it'll get ugly at any given moment. Dougie Shears, who won twice this year, who actually won Chicago and then won the most recent Dover event, slips up high, but just enough room to get in between Jordan Hetzer and Casey Hutchinson. That could have been a scary situation if he had no room. Uh-oh. Keith 
Batson, Ann Batson, excuse me, was looking really, really in a dangerous predicament there for a moment. Now they're starting to go all kinds of three abreast racing going on. The leader right now is Christina Cowan, ironically, the one who really needs points. Tim Gardner is now in the top five. He's wanting to get the points lead back. How about some tight racing over here? Tim Gardner's going to get the number one spot from Christina Cowan. There's Emily Johnson getting into the mix of things. Here comes Gerald Dick, Matt. As this is going to be some notorious three abreast racing. As long as nothing disastrous strikes, that's usually what you want. Faith Johnson, actually, one of those drivers up on the high side. Keith Batts is starting to move up through the field. See Jacob Rodriguez over there, too. Right now, Emily Johnson takes the lead from Gabriella Bryan. There's Alexander Wilson. Leach. Uh oh, we got ourselves a four breast situation coming up. 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 Uh, no. That was close. We saw four wide, and I don't know how they got through that. Jacob Rodriguez was there. Andre Castro. That was close. You know, I bet there was beads of sweat coming down those drivers' heads when they realized that they were in where they were. That was a classic case of luck. Nick Knox, who's also trying to go for points, too. So he's not one of the guys who is, has a mathematical shot at winning. He's actually getting in there. Keith Batts is going to take the lead from... Nope, not yet. Adam Fiegel will still lead that lap. We still got a long way to go. It's only eight laps in. We're not even at the ten lap mark. Here comes Trey Roberts now in there in the Splitfire Spark Plugs Lumina. I mean, excuse me, Splitfire Spark Plugs Olds. Adam Chambers following suit. Adam Chambers. There's Zed Weinstein. Here comes Adam Chambers to the inside. You'll see Keith Batson going up way high. Although... Weinstein's going to try to make a move. I almost thought we were going to see another four abreast. We could see four abreast coming, and that's playing with fire. Yo, there we go. Adam Chambers in the wall. Keith Batson's in the wall. Kelsey McEwen said Weinstein has ran away with the field. Who has not been a victim of it? Yeah. A bunch of drivers. Keith and Batson. Keith Batson. Faith Johnson. Trey Roberts, who was looking solid. Alexander Wilson Leach. Ralph Green, our winner at Richmond. Kelsey McEwen. Christian Brandon. Gerald Igmat. Zed Weinstein's going to lead the field. But let's go into what we saw there. Tough break. That was. We saw it. You got lucky once. You can't get lucky a bunch of times. You. There's. You play with fire once. It's one thing. You play with fire again. You're going to get burned. That's a guarantee. Let's see where it all came about. It was because it got tight over here. Nick Nuss, Trey Roberts, Adam Chambers, and. Kelsey McEwen. That's where it got tight. Knots touch Chambers. It can be touch McEwen. Went to Chambers. Went into Trey Roberts. Keith Batson. Got a little bit of a touch. It went right into Grace Gunnan. Tim Gardner. Grace Good had going up extremely bonkers there. Riding that wall on the front. You see Gerald Ickmack gets spun. Jacob Rodriguez. Keith Batson, of course. Emily. Oh, Alexander Wilson Leach. Jason Wong. Dougie Shears. Andre Castro, 
Ann Batson, Darnell Jones, uh, Lena Savage, a tough break for Tim Guard, and then they were still bumping around because it was all a big mess. Diana Panic getting a touch by Ralph Green, getting spun out, so. There was so much stuff going on here. Apparently, I don't know where, why, why, but it got all congested. I think that was where it came about with Hayden Klein and Faith Johnson getting involved. That was not pretty. We probably lost a good chunk of the field. Zed Weinstein won the race back to the line. That's obvious. So, very good so far. Zed Weinstein is leading. Courtney Winterbauer, second. Charles Jackson, Jack Richards, Jordan Hanser, your top five. Then Adam Fagel, Dunn, Laprad, Ken Johnson, Casey Hutchinson, and our pool to Grace Friedman dropping back to 10th. Ed Garner, Juliet Leonard, Celia Brewer, Jacob Rodriguez. Dougie Shears, Christina Cowan, Emily Johnson, Hayden Klein, Matt Richards, and Tim Freilich. Right now... Christina is liking where she is thus far. Aiden Klein and Matt, then Matthew Richards and Tim Brelick, then Mike Doobie, Matthew Rodriguez, Jeremy Doobie, our points leader Faith Johnson now in 24th, Andre Castro, Jason Wong, Ann Batson, Darnell Jones, Diana Panna, Keith Batson, Nick Knotts, Lena Savage, and Adam Chambers. You could say Adam Alexander Wilson Leach is still in. So he'll go down to the inside when we go back to the green flag. As we are eight laps to go. That should be seven laps to go when we go green flag racing. But you could say Adam Chambers, Ralph, I mean, Al, I mean Gabrielle O'Brien, Ralph Green, Christian Brandon, Trey Roberts, Kelsey McEwen, Grace Gunnan, Tim Gardner, and Gerald Dickman. That's going to hurt Tim's chances in the points. So right now, not a good day so far. You got seven laps to go. If you're Christina Cowan, Faith Johnson, Keith Batson, Nick Knotts, you need to turn a corner now. So it'll be seven laps to go with Zed Weinstein leading. So, let's see if Zed... Ironically, your top four have not won yet this year. Zed has not won. Courtney has not won. Charles Jackson has came close but has never won. Jack Richards has come close, but not not yet. Jordan Hetzer is right now in the fifth spot. He won our first Darlington event earlier in the spring. So, let's see what will happen. Seven laps to go. Here, at Atlanta, the Slick 5300. Pace car drops off. They come down into the green flag, and we are away. Zed Weinstein leads. Faith, excuse me. Jack Richards in the McDonald's Ford move to the inside of Charles Jackson. Same with Andre Ka uh, Adam Fiegel. The Richard Petty. 43. He's gotten in the top five. There's Dunn Laprat, our winner at the most recent event at Martinsville. He also won at Las Vegas. Ken Johnson right behind. Zed Weinstein little, still leads, but. Now we go back into our three wider thon here. Everybody starts to blend in. There is Christina Cowan in the 15th spot. Very good showing. Our points leader way back here in 25th, Faith Johnson. Keith Batson way back in 30th. But we got a battle going on for the lead. Here comes Andre Ka Adam Fiegel. Five laps to go. Zed Weinstein's going to have to give up the number one spot. Behind them, we got some three abreast racing. Here comes Ed Gardner, Ken Johnson. Getting in there. Juliet Leonard, the winner at Nazareth. Dun Lapred now getting into the second spot on Zed Weinstein. Here comes Christina Cowan, our, pro, our number two in the points right now, trying to seize every ounce of points that she could get knowing that the distant 
points leader, second place points leader is far away in the field. Now the field's starting to really start to tighten up a little bit. As now we got a new leader, Dunn Laprat's going to go on the inside of Adam Fiegel. Three to go. Still anybody's race. There is Juliet Leonard, the winner at Nazareth now in there. There's our pole sitter still in the mix of things. She's up there now. And she's starting to move up the field now. Zed Weistide with the middle of things. Two laps to go. As now Juliet Leonard's got the lead, but here comes our pole sitter. Grace Friedman. Inside. Got it. So she's looking to go wire to wire. We still got one and a half laps to go but right now she holds the tone still anybody's race here's Zed Weinstein again I'm coming to the line white flag one more lap to go who's gonna lead this lap the white flag is gonna be a dead heat but that's not the one that matters this is the lap that matters Zed Weinstein's got it Zed Weinstein enough momentum has got it down the back straight away here comes Casey Hutchinson. They drag, they battle it back and forth. Zip it back down to the inside is Grace Friedman. They head out of turns number three and four. Coming towards the checkered flag. Grace Friedman will regain the lead and have enough momentum. Checkered flag getting set to fly. Your winner here in Atlanta. Grace Friedman goes wire to wire in a one lap battle. Zed Weinstein, who had a shot at winning, drops the second. Casey Hutchinson will be third. Hayden Klein fourth. And Celia Brewer rounding out the top five. Then Jordan Hesser, Tim Freilich. Juliet Leonard, Jacob Rodriguez, and Emily Johnson, your top ten. Then Ed Gardner, Andre Castro, Christina Cowan, that's going to help him or her in the points. Dunn Laprad, Matthew Rodriguez, Adam Fiegel, Ken Johnson, Jack Richards, Charles Jackson, Darnell Jones, Dougie Shears, Courtney Winterbauer, Matt Richards, Jeremy Doobie, Lena Savage, Adam Chambers, Faith Johnson in a 27th spot. Not a very good day for Adam, for uh, Faith. Then Mike Doobie, Diana Panic, Keith Batson, Ann Batson, Nick Knotts, Jason Wong, then Alexander Wilson Leach, who was a lap down, Grace Bryan, Ralph Green, Christian Brannon, Trey Roberts, Kelsey McEwen, Grace Gunnan, Trey, Tim Gardner, and Gerald Ickmat. So it was a wild race. Winner on a pole and then took it back in the last lap. Grace Friedman will take the win. And that'll look at us at the points. So we get to four more events left. Faith Johnson still holds on to the points lead. Is Christina Cowan now only 77 points behind? Keith Batson is falling behind more at 198 points. Then it's Nick Knotts, Andre Castro, your top five. Then Tim Fralick, Tim Gardner, Hayden Klein, Kelsey McEwen, and Dougie Shears. Hayden's actually moving up the points now. Then Jordan Hetzer, Mike Doobie, Gerald Ickmat. Ralph Green, Celia Brewer, Adam Fiegel, Juliet Leonard, Alexander Wilson Leach, Casey Hutchinson, and Adam Chambers, your top 20. Then Emily Johnson and Gabriella Bryan. Darnell Jones, Matthew Rodriguez, Don Laprad, Matt Richards, Grace Friedman, Jason Wong, Jack Richards, Courtney Winterbauer, Ken Johnson, Trey Roberts, Zed Weinstein with a top 5 finish, gets him in the 30 for third. Jeremy Doobie, Jacob Rodriguez, Ed Gardner, Diana Panic, Charles Jackson, Grace Gunnan, Christian Brandon, Lena Savage, and Ann Batson. So, four more events left. Time to turn up the wick. Going to Phoenix. The Fordparts.com 200. That's coming up next, but we got the Sunoco Cup cars.